elf. A Darth ear. You dare attack us? You and the rest of your sun-cursed race of traitors will die for crossing us. My attack? You presume much. The Dwarven Mines were to be ours, but we care nothing for the Sunset Mountains or your filthy surface cities. Those have been promised to others, and they may have them. Can it be that you've come all this way without knowing your enemy? Then it is ignorance that has made you brave. You will soon choke on your own screams, intruder. And then I shall offer up your body to Lolth.
field. Never will you see such fine steel as you will in this shop. Swords, axes, hammers, we have more than enough weapons for everyone. If you feel the need to part with your gold, you've come to the right place, traveler. How can I help you? Are you looking for anything in particular? Never will you see such fine steel as you will in this shop. Swords, axes, hammers, we have more than enough weapons for everyone. If you feel the need to part with your gold, you've come to the right place, traveler. I'm not strong enough to carry anymore. How can I help you? Are you looking for anything in particular? Never will you see such fire.
I'm not strong enough to carry it. This looks important. I'm not strong enough to carry anymore. No room. I'll have to come back for this. Sunset Mountains. There was something stirring within the mountains, organizing the gnolls, the ogres. Then the dragon appeared. Uh, I know little, but the fact that dark elves are working with them is a cause for worry. Whatever leads this army, it must be powerful to have such troops as allies. I heard the drow speak often of their plans. Their goal was to exterminate the Dwarven settlement here, in order to protect the movements of the gnolls and ogres in the mountains. In exchange for their help, they were promised the mines, and all within it. Aye, aye. Though I know not why, they care nothing for the gnolls and ogres. A gate. I, I heard the drow speak of a gate, but it led to the marsh of Chilimber, not Baldur's Gate. I had been searching for the source of the troubles in the region when the drow struck the mines. If my hunch proves true, then the gate to the marsh may lie within an ice cave within the mountains. I will mark it on your map. Finding your way to it may prove to be a trick, but you should be able to reach the cave from the mining camp. Now the cave itself is sealed with a great sheet of ice, though I think the drought priestess made mention of some horn she used to enter the cave. If these gates are the work of the creature behind these attacks, then ye must travel to the Marsh of Chilimber and find out the nature of this threat. I fear you're right, friend. I fear you're right. Well, let us squander no more time talking of it. Find the gate and take the battle to the beast that's stalking us. There are no enemies here. Swords, axes, hammers. We have more than enough weapons for everyone.
I was worried for you. What news of the mines? Do the Dark Elves still hold them? Klingerden has truly blessed us this day. You have reversed our fortunes, and we shall never forget it. Have this, and with it, know you have the thanks of the Brunger clan as well. Brogan's alive! Thrice blessed are we! A nice cave, eh? I've heard something of it from Brogan before, but I didn't think it linked to our troubles. If you go searching for it, be careful. More dangerous beasts than wolves and yeti lair on this mountain. I was worried for it. There are no enemies here.
I'm not strong enough to carry anymore. 